All right, um, you asked a question about how I'd go about changing the ball nut. Hopefully I can keep everything in view here. This is an old screw I have that I haven't done anything with. And um, what I did was to do this, I go to the hardware store and I bought some thin wall half inch tubing. And then I cut me a short piece of it. And I turned the, in, the OD of the tubing here down to 0 0.540 I believe it is. Hold on just a second. I'm trying to keep this in focus but yeah 0 0.540 and then put in an, a rod that will fit internally in the vise like this. Okay then once this is turned down to 0 0.540 you would hold your ball screw tightly firmly against this let me back around here and make sure I can see everything in view. Alright. Hold your ball screw straight and firmly against the end of the plastic tube. Of course, I got a lot of things in the way. Bring it up. Bring your ball nut up. Let me get close here. Now you got to make sure you maintain contact as you do this so the balls don't drop out. And we're going to make the plastic the ball nut feed down onto this plastic tube. Now holding firmly just keep turning and as you can see the ball nut is working its way down onto the plastic tube. Just keep screwing and there you have it. Now all your balls are contained inside here and everything's locked down and then to take it and put it on your other screw you would do the same thing bring it back up trying to center it it's kind of easy when you already got one that's pre-machined and just start turning and you'll feel it start and keep maintaining the pressure and as you're doing it screw your ball nut all the way back on your screw and there you go there it is no balls inside, nothing lost.